Apex speaking with Empire Energy's Alex Underwood this morning. Alex, morning. G'day, Andrew. Look, kicking some uh, some big goals, Alex, in the Beetaloo, moving closer to, to gas sales. You've announced this week here you've agreed drilling and stimulation contracts here for the Carpentaria uh, pilot project. A milestone. Tell us a bit more. Yeah, so uh, as we discussed a while ago, we, we raised close to $50 million a few months ago, and that's for the specific purpose of drilling and stimulating the Carpentaria 5H well. And consistent with that strategy, we've recently signed a drilling contract with Ensign, which uh, will see the well drilled in late October and through to November. And also we've, we've signed a stimulation contract with Halliburton, the world's largest provider of stimulation services, which will see us uh, doing the hydraulic stimulation of that well closer to Christmas and then uh, flow rates out in Q1. So a very exciting time for us. And so looking at gas sales middle of next year, how material will that be for Empire? Uh, I mean, we've been an explorer for some time now and um, I think it's the holy grail of exploration companies to move into production and you know, we've been working very hard as a team to achieve that goal. And with this well being drilled and the two other wells that will hook into sales, the gas plant that we bought last year that we'll be installing in the field in the second quarter of next year, where we're now looking at moving into production in the middle of next year. And I must say, it, it can't come at a more important time. The MT's electricity system is completely relying on gas. Um, and, you know, there's a big shortfalls of gas in the NT at the moment, so we're looking forward to doing our bit to provide energy security for the people of the NT. And look, Alex, just away from the Beetaloo, uh, last week you did your bit uh, for a very worthwhile cause. It was called CEO uh, Walk in My Shoes, raising money for Ronald McDonald House Charities Sydney. Tell us a bit more about the initiative and how you found the experience. Yeah, sure. So Ronald McDonald House Charities is an incredible um, cause. They they provide accommodation for the families of very sick kids, particularly people who don't live in the proximity of the hospitals where their kids are being treated. Um, believe it or not, there's 193 of the houses around the world, uh, and they've been providing this accommodation and support for families for 50 years now. Um, I actually found out about it from my wife, who's been supporting the cause for a number of years. And so, yeah, they approached me about uh, getting involved. And I, I must say it was an incredible experience. I mean, when you think about, you know, the, the many worthy causes out there, I mean, keeping uh, very unwell kids close to their families, I think, you know, it's not only, not only good for them and their families, but also good for better health outcomes. And so, yeah, it was a you know, a pretty uh, life-changing moment, to be honest. I mean, um, you know, I'm very blessed to have a healthy family and, um, you know, to be able to support them was great. And, um, you know, I think for people watching this, it's it's important to note that, you know, Ronald McDonald House Charities, they, they get about 15% of their funding from Ronald McDonald's, the corporation, about 12% from the government, and they are heavily reliant on the support of, donors. So, um, you know, I'd, I'd strongly encourage anyone watching to, you know, check it out and uh, lend your support if you can. And you set a goal of 5,000 uh, and raised more than 15. So a great achievement. Oh, thank you. Yeah, I mean, you know, I'm very appreciative of the support of our friends and a lot of stakeholders of our company who supported that initiative. It's going to fund close to 100 nights of accommodation for and board for families. So, you know, very appreciative to everyone who supported it. And, um, you know, we'll certainly be continuing to do so ourselves. Yeah, a fantastic initiative. Alex, good to see you. Thanks for your time. Thanks, Andrew. Cheers, mate.